What's going on guys? Welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. In today's video, I'm gonna show you one of the best ways to power your base early on in the game. Maybe you're at a point where you feel that solar panels are not doing enough for you anymore. And let's be honest, when it's nighttime in Subnautica Below Zero, solar panels sucks. If you feel the same way, then this video is definitely for you. This is gonna be a really quick video because what you need to use in order to power your base early on is actually quite simple. You will need to build and use the bioreactor, which is the blueprint you unlock just by yeah, crafting the habitat builder. If you're struggling to find the blueprint for the habitat builder, I'm gonna put a link here in the top right corner of the video to show you where to find this. Alright, so I assume that you've already built a nice little base of yours, so what you need to start out with is a big room that has the space for this monstrosity of a bioreactor, which has to stand in the middle of the room. You have to be able to build a big room for this reactor because it takes up a lot of space. So you can either build a multi-purpose room, which is the one I'm using because it's nice. It's also <laughs> it's the cheapest option. However, you can also build a so-called large room where the bioreactor can also be placed. The multi-purpose room can be found and scanned at an island called Delta Island, not far from your life, but actually. So call me out in the comment section if you need some guidance to find this island. So, after you have acquired the habitat builder and the multi-purpose room, put down your bioreactor and now the only thing that we are missing is, yeah, probably also the most important thing, the fuel to power it. So, the bioreactor can only run on organic stuff found in Subnautic Below Zero like fish, plants, <laughs> the small penguins, seeds and so on. However, all of the different organic items have different organic values, meaning that some things do not power your bioreactor as efficiently as other things. So in order to just skip ahead of the long list of potential candidates for fuel you can use, I'm just gonna tell you the best fuel to use, which is something called root pustule. It's a raw material found in the Arctic kelp caves and it contains highly reactive compounds, which is yeah really good for the bioreactor. Each root pustule generates 700 power, which is yeah, it's pretty good compared to the next best thing being the Arctic pepper fish, which yeah, it only generates 350 power per unit. All right, so you have to make your way to the Arctic kelp caves, which can be found rather close to your life path, but you do, however, have to find one of the entrances, which can sometimes be pretty challenging. In order to find one of the entrances, put yourself on your life pod like this and align yourself with this small purple plant here and after this go in a straight line and in approximately 180 meters from your life pod you'll find one of the entrances. What you're looking for are these orange glowing bubbles growing on these big branches. And from here all you have to do is just pick them up and return to your base with them. Being back in your base, put the root pustule into the slots inside the bioreactor and see your base return to full energy. You can also do like I've done and put down some storage for the remaining root pustule that cannot fit inside the bioreactor. You have to know however that items put into the bioreactor cannot be removed once placed inside. There you have it guys, I hope you all got your bases fully powered. If you liked the video and it helped you, throw me some love by liking the video or subscribe to my channel. I put out a lot of Subnautica Below Zero content and subscribing is basically free, so <laughs> you can always go back and unsubscribe if one day you're not feeling it anymore. No hard feelings. Also, write to me in the comments if you have some questions or maybe you have found a better way to power your base than using Root Postule and the Bioreactor. But for now, See you in the next video.